shines bright at night Take a stroll uptown Where people can enjoy the Before we start this video, I'd like to thank our sponsor, No One. Welcome back to Brew Review Winnipeg. We're doing the Kilter Space Jam Jammy IPA. I am so looking forward to doing this, because Space Jam was my jam back in the day. Because we're talking basketball, oh yeah. That MJ, just, just jamming it with the Space Jam with Bugs Bunny and, and, and Tweety and Sylvester and, and Daffy Duck and Martian, Mars Martian, Martian Man, what's his name? And, and Tasmanian Devil and Babs, that's her name, right? The, the, the lady? Yeah, the hot bunny. Is it Babs or, yeah, whatever, whoever she is. That was my jam and then we found out that Michael, Michael Jordan's a, a really not the greatest individual off the court or even on the court. There's lots of evidence to support that. Anyways, uh, so this bad boy is 6.7% alcohol. I don't even know if you can find this in the store anymore because it was very limited batch released. This beer is perishable. Time is of the essence. It is right there. A super fruity and jammy IPA dry hopped with galaxy and jam packed with a slam jam of kilter berries. Let's, uh, without further ado, crack this bad boy open. Oh, oh, -ho -ho. it's 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 a uh, it's a nice color. I can tell already. This is gonna be good. You know how I've always been uh, complaining that blueberry beers aren't blue. I would complain that the Space Jam Jammy IPA isn't a jam colored uh, beer, but you can tell by, by right here how I'm pouring it, this is most definitely a jam colored and super creamy looking beer. <laughs> like a kid in a candy store. <laughs> oh. That smells so good. It smells fruity and 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 uh, jammy and, and oh, it's it's like a tart raspberry Saskatoon and strawberry all rolled into one. Oh yeah. Well, cheers. Oh yeah. That is surprisingly creamy for how tart it is. This is like a tart, creamy kind of sour beer. I'm not, I'm, I'm going to be honest with all y'all, I'm not the biggest fan of sours. I've had a number of them and there's maybe one or two that I truly enjoy. Uh, but this bad boy is an exception. You know how sometimes when berry products can have kind of that artificial kind of taste to them? Not this bad boy. This bad boy is a hundred percent just juicy and 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 very nice and 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 just real this is just a real beer honestly I would want just a little bit more hops in this like if you go too hoppy it, it just trying to it drowns out all of the berry goodness but I would I would want just a little bit more but oh this is just this is just delicious oh yeah um, even the squirrels are agreeing with me. They they want a piece of this, but they're not getting any. <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah, that's some good stuff. Uh, I'm gonna give this bad boy a, a, a eight and a eight eight point eight point seven five out of ten. I gotta be more lenient with my with, with my marking. So eight point seven five out of ten is what I'm gonna give this bad boy. Uh, yeah. This thing's just very delicious. Uh, thank you, Kilter. Continue doing what you're doing. And until next time, Winnipeg. Brew on, eh? Oh, yeah. I was talking loud and obnoxious enough. Because this one's still going, right? 
Ha 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 ha! Ho 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 ho!